John is a farmer who lives in Mamu village in Buwe in southwest Cameroon. The region has benefited from the collection of palm wine. According to John, the money he earns from collecting palm wine has not only improved his quality of life, but also puts his five children through school. John bought a piece of land in the forest 20 years ago and began to grow raffia palm trees. He now has 400 raffia trees, 12 produce wine. While paying a visit to the palm tree plantation, John told CNC a palm tree can produce wine after seven years. When the leaves of the palm tree bend, they're ready to produce. John says the wine production period lasts only two months. Afterward, the tree is useless. It will be dropping in the gallon. In the gallon, inside. Yes. In the morning, I'll come and collect it. Oh. Then when I, when I collect it, he then cuts it down and uses it as firewood. John showed us how to collect wine. He climbs the tree and cuts it until the wine flows out. He then uses a barrel to gather the liquid. John collects wine twice a day, once in the morning, the other at night. He says he can collect around 60 liters of wine a day and sells it to the owner of a bar in the village. He gets about 12 US dollars for doing so. I only collect on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so it is there that I've made of my own life, bring up my own family, sponsor my children in school for sickness and everything. I know that uh, this, my business is really bringing me to a, at least I live as. Janita, the bar owner, told CNC the villagers enjoy drinking the wine. Customers say the palm wine is good for their health. They believe it prevents them from acquiring malaria. Fans of the wine who hail from the city appreciate its natural quality. The income derived from selling the wine provides John with a modest income. It's enough to pay for his children's school and he even has some left over to buy some extra essentials and pay for hospital bills. And for John, that's all, for now, he could ask for.